Presenting the 210 10 kg bags of beans and 53 5 kg bags of rice to the state government, the Orion local government APC party chairman, Elder Ben Ogumu, who represents the party chairman from the 18 local government area, said the gesture is to support the state government in cushioning the effect of the coronavirus in the state. He also commended the state governor, Mr. Baseki, especially in the area of education. We are here to put our support to the ravaging COVID-19. We have seen how the state has performed in terms of everything, in terms of salary, especially salary of teachers, pensioners, introduction by your government for our children, the way other states are emulating the type of education, the style of education you have brought to those states. Responding, Comrade Philip Shaibu described the gesture as laudable and first of its kind in the history of Nigeria. Edo State Deputy Governor said the APC party chairman from the 18 local government areas have exhibited remarkable feats by their donation of relief materials to assist the state government. Comrade Philip Shaibu called on residents to adhere to all government directives to curb the COVID-19 pandemic. For us, it's not just about being in power. It's about making change. And all of you, chairman, also are product of that change. And that change you are displaying today. Because you are the first in this country that is contributing to the welfare of our people, believing that the vulnerables in our society must be adequately taken care of because of the partial shutdown. In another development, the Nigerian Youth Parliament has described the murder of late Vera Uwaila Omozua by some persons in a place of worship as devilish and abominable which should not be allowed to continue in the society. Minority leader of the parliament, Daniel Uwadiai, in company with other members while briefing government house correspondents, condemned the act and called on security agencies to ensure justice. We urge all Nigerians to let their voice to condemn this inhuman act and seek justice for her and other victims of such atrocities. To our fellow youths, we would like to remind you that it's our collective responsibility to ensure that the most vulnerable in our society receive full protection of the law. They also thanked the state government and the law enforcement agencies for the efforts made so far to arrest the perpetrators of the crime. Patience, O Saugiwa, reporting.